Hello everyone, welcome to Part of Rosa's World. Um, and thank you to those of you that will be um, re-watching the replay later. And I already see, sorry to keep a few of you waiting. I had to um, take the thumbnail pic. But I said, sorry, I see right there, but hold on, I'm gonna pull up the chat over here. But hi Bax, how are you? Um, you know, and they're actually not um, all movies, only two of them are DVDs. The other two items, one's a lithograph and then the other one is this like, hi Juan, how are you? It's the little um, mermaid like party pack they called it. And then I wasn't able to hold in the picture this other bag that I got as well. Hi Tiffany, how are you? Um, so that one I couldn't, you know, fit in the picture and that's why, oops, sorry you guys, I, again, I keep moving the table. Hold on, sorry guys, I'm trying to see how can I fix that. Maybe I gotta scoot away from the table so I don't move you guys that much. Um, if they think it's all better and set up. Hold on, in the meantime, sorry guys, I just wanna, I know I missed a few more other comments. Oh yeah, thank you, Bax. Yeah, I seen that, that I'm almost at um, 200. That's pretty cool and awesome. You know, I appreciate the love and support from everyone. Um, I guess in the meantime, you know, while well, we see who else will join us. I'll go ahead and share first the bag. This one is a bag from the Ralph Breaks the Internet because um, this is the only one that's not Little Mermaid theme. Um, Juan, you know, it will, if it's okay, it is going to be during Halloween time. Halloween time. I don't know why I can't say it right. Um, I will DM you on Instagram if that's okay to kind of more share that information, but it will be for Halloween time and my first time actually. Hi, Jelly's Journeys. How are you? That's my first, or the, I can't, can't even say it. That will be my first time that I have gone to the parks for Halloween time. It actually looks, you know, pretty cool and awesome. And, you know, I really want to experience it and get to see it during the holiday. Because, you know, I've gone to go, let's see, the first time I went, it was in the summer, I believe in June, a couple years back, let's see, maybe, actually, like, you know, almost six years ago, the first time I went in June of the summertime, then the following year, it was during Thanksgiving week, where we got to see, you know, a lot of the Christmas decorations already up, and then followed by a couple of years, my last trip, that was mid-August. When I got to go. Now this still has the tags and everything. You know what I'm trying to see guys. So I don't know which way. You probably won't see my face for a minute while I hold it up. Um, but this was a cool bag. Uh, now the only thing is I don't know how much uh, my boyfriend paid for it. Because he's the one who is in charge. Sorry guys I was just checking over there real quick. Out there by the window. Um, but he's the one in charge of like the Disney Movie Club, you know, he just orders the things here and there or he'll show me, be like, hey, you know, are you interested in this? And of course, when I seen, you know, this bag, I was like, oh, I want the bag. Um, there's like a little pocket right there. And then I don't know how well I'm able to show you guys. But then as you can see the inside, I'll probably actually even use it like maybe once or twice. Hi, John, how are you? Happy Friday to you too. But I'll show again the bag and don't mind the noise you might hear in the background or little dwarf hamster back there decided to drink some water right now so if you hear that noise that is what you're hearing right now <laughs> and then the next things even though I already have you know the little mermaid the one that Target came out with yeah you heard him one yeah that's Rhino back there drinking some water <laughs> um, the one that comes like in a storybook style included, that one's their Target, but these are from the Disney Movie Club. And we got, you know, Disney Little Mermaid. And this one has the 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray and a digital code. And then we also got from the Disney Movie Club, The Little Mermaid 2 Return to the Sea and The Little Mermaid Ariel's Beginning. Sorry, guys, I'm trying to see. And then, sorry, I just want to make sure I'm keeping up with your guys' comments again. Like always, you know, I have you guys over here on my phone because it makes it makes it a little bit easier for me to try not to miss all of your guys' comments. 
And yeah, yes, John, me too. You know, love Disney. Or Disney movies, John. Yeah, me too. So hard to decide, you know, if I get like asked like, well, which one's your favorite? You know, it's so hard because there's so many good Disney movies. And then next up is the Little Mermaid lithograph. And then just so you can see the back there. I'll actually um, take out of the envelope so we can, you know, take a look at it better. And then on the back is just blank. You know what? Sorry, guys, I'm going to show the print a little better. <laughs> so then there's that. You know what? I think I'll put that away later. That way it doesn't make too much noise. Then next they had, I don't know, sorry guys, I'm going, it's me, Mario. Oh, you know, I keep forgetting I need to remove those Marios out of the way when I go live, at least in this area. But right, yeah, it's me, Mario. Here's this up. Yes, of course, because of the balloons. Um, so this is a Disney movie. It says, Amazing Party Pack. And I actually have an... Um, I mean, I've gone through it and looked, but I haven't yet, like, you guys will see in a minute when I show you guys. Oh, yes, I did see the trailer for that, John. You know, it looks awesome. I know, Yoshi. So I'm going to go ahead and open up. There's several things in here. Maybe I'll kind of try to go just a little bit slowly through that way. Um, you know, we don't go too fast sharing all this stuff because I just decided to you know hey Death Star Diva how are you and yes yay you made it I know it doesn't you know help that I I was even debating if I was gonna go live today um, usually you know I go later on and, or I come on or let's see I can't even let me rephrase that usually um, last Friday you know when I had gone live when we played the game it was um, later on in the evening but today for me you know later in the evening wouldn't work out for me I had some time right now and I said, you know what, okay, I'll just, you know, hop on and see who's able to uh, make it and join. I mean, before I um, move on to the amazing party pack, I just want to show Nikki real quick the bag that I had shared. Um, Nikki, we got this from part of the Disney Movie Club. It's a cute little... I forget what kind of style bag you call this, but, and then see. Oh, thank you, Nikki. Oh, and then I'll briefly share real quick again. That's what I was looking at, what Juan said, messenger bag. I couldn't remember. Thank you, Juan. Hi, Jesse Robert Garza, how are you? And then I'll show briefly again real quick, the lithograph. Hey, Marseille, how are you? So now with that little pack, well, let's see, sorry guys, I'm just trying to, um, again, guys, sorry if I happen to look down, you know, I have you guys over here on the phone so I can try my best to, you know, not, or to get to all your guys' comments, even though I know I still, you know, miss some here and there, but I try my best. I do feel bad that when, you know, later on, like, I'll rewatch, replay, and I'm like, oh no, I missed, you know, a comment here and there. But I am glad to hear you are doing great, Jesse Robert Garza. And yes, John, great Disney movie, The Little Mermaid. So then in the part before, hi, Disney World Adventures, how are you? So now there's several things in the pack. I'm trying to think which way to start. Aw, thank you, Marseille. Sorry, just looking down at reading Grace's comments. Yes, um, Disney World Adventures at Happy Friday. Loving the decor. Uh, you know, I'll actually, oh good, thank you um, for letting me know, Jesse. I appreciate that. And I'll actually get um, afterwards, you know, the these little, like, I guess I would, they're not necessarily like backdrops, but I guess that's what I'll call them for now. I'll show you guys afterwards where those came from, and I just decided, you know what, why not put them back there. But so in this pack, it came with first, it had two recipes. First it says Little Mermaid Treats. Sorry guys, I don't know. I don't mean to cover my face, but that way you guys can kind of see a little bit better. And then in the back it has the ingredients and stuff and how to make it. You know, if, because I know you may not be able to 
um, see it that well. If you're interested, you know, in this little recipe, let me know, and I can, um, you know, send it or not send it. Take a picture of it and send it to you guys through either on Instagram. If you guys don't follow me yet, you know, also please go check out my Instagram. And also that way, you know, if you would like the recipe for this first treat, I can DM it to you on Instagram. Or I am also on Facebook. I have a Part of Rosa's World page as well with a Part of Rosa's World group. If you guys haven't yet joined that already. And that's where we can also, you know, message each other if you guys would like, you know, that recipe. And then don't mind the loud sound we're going to hear for a few minutes a truck driving by. <laughs> And then this is a Little Mermaid smoothie bowl. Yes, as I can tell on my end too, it doesn't look that well for you guys to see the ingredients, but um, I was gonna say, you guys can, um, like I said, message me Instagram or on the Facebook, and I can you know, take a picture of the recipe and um, message it to you guys. And then these are some stickers it came with. You know, sorry guys, I don't mean to um, block my face. I still got to work on, you know, like sharing stuff and not block my face. And then, let's see if I did some tattoos. Okay, Death Star Diva, yeah, for sure. I know we already um, follow each other on Instagram, so I will, you know, I should have grabbed a pen and paper. But I, I'll remember to um, send you the picture of the recipe of the smoothie one, correct? Let me go see real quick. Uh, thank you, Juan. I, Juan shared the Instagram. So for those of you who don't follow me, there you already. And also if you would like the any of the recipes. Yeah, you know, I think it was a smoothie. But the good thing I'll be able to go back to also remember in case I forget. But I'm pretty sure I won't. Juan, yes, Death Star Diva. Hold on, sorry guys, I'm just looking real quick because then I know the comments disappear so quickly over there. Well, thank you, Bax. Yes, just Robert Garza, you um, follow me already actually on um, both. It's not the nice truck. So I was sharing the tattoos. You know what, I'll reshare again because I don't remember if I shared them long enough. But there's the tattoos that came in that pack. And then these I still have to figure out. It has the directions, you know, what I need to do. But it says, these are Mermazing Party Pack Treat Baskets. And it has the directions and tells me what I need to do. You know, actually, I'm going to lock my face for a minute and show you guys. And it, you know, tells me what I need to do to, I guess, build those treat baskets. So that one's of Sebastian. And then there's one with, oh, sorry, I want to make sure I don't have it backwards. Flounder. And then... Hold on, sorry guys, I'm just going back and seeing any comments, make sure I don't miss anything. Or just in the group chat, Death Star Diva? Okay. Yeah, and if any, hi Cargo, how are you? Um, For those of you know, the, wait, hold on, sorry guys, I'm trying to talk to myself, but hi Disney, and how are you? If I get any new um, requests for the group, you know, I will be looking at those after the stream, you know, to um, accept the request. Okay, John, well, thank you for stopping by. You have a great night as well, you and your family, and have a great weekend as well, John. And then, let's see. Hold on, sorry, guys. I'm just trying to keep in order what else is left, because there was, like I said, quite a few things inside this little amazing was it party pack this I plan to um, in the other room where I usually you know go on on Mondays I plan to put this in the background let's see if I know it's probably looking backwards you guys but it says springtime fun for everyone like a little banner and then let's see Sorry, guys. I'm like, where do I need to show next? <laughs> and then these are um, Amazing Party Pack Egg Stands, which actually is a pretty cool um, thing to have with, you know, Easter almost around the corner. So it has that one, and then it has one more. And again, these are, sorry, the egg stands. 
And then the last thing in the pack, I don't think I may have to stand up to show this one because it's a little bit bigger. You know, sorry guys, bear with me while I do put my chair a little bit back. And I think I will have to stand up to show you guys this. At least as best as I can. Or maybe, you know what guys, maybe I'll do this. And with trying to kind of get the glare out of there though. Let's see, I think this may work. No, nope, wait, kind of. Sorry, guys, about that glare. I know I still got to kind of work around, you know, that with not having so much glare when I share some of my items with you guys. So this one, sorry, guys, let me just fix myself back over here now. <laughs> and then, hold on, let's see. Sorry, guys, I'm just going back. I'm making sure I'm not reading. And <laughs> you guys are... So it just says you help Sebastian join the fun. And then as you can see, Sebastian kind of there. It's supposed to be a fun little game. I'll actually show you guys the pieces that go with it. But it says how to play. You pop out the game pieces. These are the game pieces. Let me put that poster down. These are the game pieces that it's talking about. But so you pop out the game pieces and apply clear tape to each piece while blindfolded. Each player takes a turn to try to tape Sebastian onto Ariel's tail. The player that gets the closest to the target wins. So it's almost kind of like um, like pin the tail on the donkey, except, you know, I guess I would say, I mean, it doesn't say that, but I'm going to call it that, you know, um, pin Sebastian on Ariel's tail. Is what that is. Oh my goodness, trying to fold this right now, I'm just like, ah. So we have in that Mermazing, what's it called? Mermazing Party Pack. I keep forgetting what the pack's called. You have the Pin Sebastian on Ariel's tail with the little pieces right here. Then it came with two of the Party Pack egg stands. Let's see if I can, I'm gonna try to do this to show it like all together what was in there. And then that Springtime Fun banner and then the Ariel flounder and Sebastian the treat baskets that I got to look at the instructions to see how I put those together and then sorry guys I just want to look because I think I'm missing a few comments and then let's see oh, I see okay what you guys are talking about and then we got the aerial tattoos, stickers, and then followed by the two recipes. Is this the Little Mermaid Berry Smoothie Bowl? And then the Little Mermaid um, Treats. Sorry, you guys, I have to go back and see what it says. So all these things, you know, were inside this Mermazing Party Pack. Oh, sorry, guys, I'm trying to take that clear out. And you know what? Actually, I will not put those back yet because I don't want to make too much crazy noise with that. So then, um, actually, you know what? Let's see. I think I'm going to stand up again. <laughs> this, let's see, one, this little poster background, and then this one over here. I forget how long ago once the party Disney World Adventures. I know, right? <laughs> they came, I don't know, I guess they're called... My busy books, uh, you'll even see in a minute, I still have the price tag on it when we bought this a while ago. But, and you know what, hold on, sorry guys, I should've, there's like a sticky part right here on this book. I should've cleaned that part off before I shared that. But I don't know if any of you guys remember these books. And then when you open them, it has like a, you know, cardboard storybook. Hi Janine, Disney DIY, how are you? And then as you can see right here, it had that little background poster like thing. And that's why it's even kind of folded up because they had to fold it and fit it in here. And then in these two boxes, it had like little mini um, characters from some of them. But as you can see, you know, those characters, I have no idea where they're at anymore because we bought this like, I don't even know how long ago. I'm trying to see if even 2011. And then, sorry, I'm trying to see point this one from Andy's room. 
And then hold on, sorry. I mean, Disney World Adventures, I'll actually show that to you if you would like in a minute after I finish wrapping up sharing um, where the book now from Andy's room background. So of course you're welcome. And I am doing good, Janine, thank you. And then this, this background came with the Toy Story Busy Books. And you know what, I actually should have showed you guys the back, but I think I will. So hold on, sorry guys, let me see real quick. Me, Juan, and Coco. Maybe I'm starting disasters. Oh, Marseille. So I'm just reading Marseille's comment. You know what, actually, oh, 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 wait, sorry guys, I want to click on anything. Maybe I'll put my phone that way and try to see if I can read it better that way. So then this busy book again has a little like, you know, story. And again, with they fold that, you know, picture back one in there and then the characters that came in here. And actually it shows in the back, the other thing is, sorry guys, because we've had these for so long, there's like some sticky, a little bit sticky stuff on it that I should have cleared off. But there's, you can see the background and then the little toys that you would play with with that background. And then let me go back and show the one. Hi, Mr. Fulton and Miss Caitlin Mraz. How are you? What is it today, Juan? It's a, oh, how many national? You know, I need to move this one closer to me. St. Patty just days everyone, Juan says. And then here's the back of this one. So I know now I'm going off a little bit, you know, sharing. But we did cover, you know, the movies and the Mermazing Party Pack. Let me go grab right behind me. You know what? Actually, I think we'll grab... You know, I'll come back for that next thing that's back there. And you know what? I actually have two magazines behind here, I've realized. Because, like, I want to get... And you know what? Hold on. I did not fix my chair right. <laughs> there we go, I think. Um, you know what? Actually, we'll take them out from the clear packaging that I have around it. Hold on, before I show them, I'm gonna read some more comments again. Oh wow, okay, it's tomorrow. Here you guys, but Universal today. I know, right, um, Journey in the spicy goodness. <laughs> so here's the Life Magazine for Mickey's 90th says life celebrates an American icon and then in the back is on that one then I also have the life Walt Disney from magic from Mickey sorry I can't even say that right from Mickey to the magic kingdom I don't know how I was reading that not the right way <laughs> and then in the back of this and then I also have Another life magazine, and this one is for Beauty and the Beast, the story of a fairy tale. And then, um, which one? I know because I know it went kind of fast. Um, Nikki, you have the Beauty and the Beast one, is that the one that you have? And I'm sorry, guys, I didn't mean to share them too fast if I did. <laughs> so I have the Beauty and the Beast one. The life of. Oh. So I'm just looking at guys' comments. And then the life Walt Disney. And then the life Mickey Mouse at 90. Um, I'm trying to say, I think, you know what? Hold on, I think it's okay, whatever I covered back there at the moment. Yeah, it's the, my son's game from Stranger Things. This, you know, I actually don't have any of, of these, but this record I found at the thrift store and I couldn't pass it up. I know I paid under a dollar, okay, Nikki, for it. And when I seen it, I just thought it was pretty cool, you know, from the Mary Poppins. And I figured, why not, you know, pick it up? Just as you can see, I just thought that was pretty cool. Says 10 songs from Walt Disney's Mary Poppins. 
And then, oh my goodness, I cannot put anything back at the moment. I'm just going to leave everything out and then I'll put it away after. <laughs> oh, thank you, Cargo. Yeah, so that's, you know, pretty much, you know what, now I've got to stop moving the phone, trying to move it over there because I don't want to miss comments. Um, you know, it, I wanted to just share starting off with, you know, the Ralph Bix, the internet messenger bag, and then the Little Mermaid, you know, lithograph, the two DVDs we shared, and then the Mermazing, you know, party pack, and then, you know, I briefly shared with you guys the Life Magazine since, you know, I had them there, um, what do you call it, in the background. You know, one last thing while I wait, you know, if you guys have any more questions, because I think uh, maybe about five more minutes or a little bit past five more minutes, um, you know, we'll be on here because I pretty much, pretty much, you know, shared the stuff I wanted to share with you guys today. But I want to grab actually one more thing in the meantime. Okay, I'm going to pause this again. Sorry, guys. Just put the ornament over there. I believe my boyfriend found this at Dimple Records, I believe. And it's the music of Disney, a legacy and song. Now it was, you know, used, but I thought, you know what, I might have to cover my whole face real quick for this. And it has um, several CDs in there with, I know you may not be able to see them, the wording as well, but um, songs. I know one of them, actually let's find out. Yeah, one of them is in my car currently. So that's why I'm missing one of them there but there's it usually has three different cds with many disney songs i'll go ahead and come out and show you guys and they're actually numbered by one two and three this one's number one. Oh, you know what hold on up no, that won't work too well the glare and it has you know i'm not even sure if i want to try to read these because there is um so many songs and so many names. Juan's asking many. Hi, the Yayas. How are you? You know, well, I am. Um, before I go off reading the songs, I do want to say, you guys, you know, um, well, I mean, first, you know, go also check everyone out that's in here if you don't already. You know, show everyone some love and support. But if you guys have not checked out the Yaya Chronicles channel yet, please, you know, go and do so and check them out. They're another awesome, great channel that I watch. And they um, have been live streaming on Wednesdays. Yeah, so I had to think about the day because, you know, I have a set schedule with my, like, my own included with, you know, several channels, live streams, you know, set for the week. Um... Like Death Star Diva too, who was um, in the chat, she said she had to step away for a minute. Um, but Death Star Diva, she has her own channel, also along with she's the wife of the Kilt Guy, and they also live stream together on the Kilt Guy's channel. Yeah, there you go. Thank you, Juan, for posting the Yaya Chronicles um, channel link. But also, again, you know, too, um, you know, check everyone out in here if you guys don't yet, you know, follow each other yet. Go show everyone, you know, so love and support. Of, ugh, I can't even say that right. Go and show each other some love and support as well to, you know, everyone else too is what I'm trying to say. Um, like, I want to say, you know, because I, I want to try not to, you know, exclude anyone, but like, Janie Disney DIY, she has some cute crafts as well. Disney World Adventures is another, you know, awesome, great channel as well. And he also live streams, you know, Cargo as well. Gosh, hopefully I'm like, I don't want to like miss any, but it just, you know, to everyone though. Oh, you're welcome, the Yaya Chronicles. You know, just show everyone some love and support here if you guys don't, you know, follow each other already. Is what I was trying to say. Sorry, I'm getting tongue twisted. <laughs> um, but, oh boy, let's see. Well, I will say some of these songs, I don't know like which movies some are from. I mean, there's some I do and some I don't. The first one says Turkey in the Straw, Who's Afraid of the Big Bad Wolf, Hi-Ho, Whistle While You Work, Someday My Prince Will Come, When You Wish Upon a Star, Give a Little Whistle, Dance of the Reed Flutes, Baby Mine, 
Love is a Song, Little April Shower, Saludos Amigos, You Belong to My Heart, Zippity Dee Doo Da. I should have said that better because that's actually I love that song. Zippity Dee Doo Da. Better I'll sing it that way instead, <laughs> instead of trying to like slowly say the name of that song. Everybody has a laughing place. The Lord is good to me. Lavender blue. A dream is a wish your heart makes. Bippity boppity boo. I'm late. The unbirthday song. The second star to the right. You can fly, you can fly, you can fly. Bella Note. I don't know if I said that right. Once Upon a Dream, Corella DeVille, and oh boy, I don't know how to say this one. Please forgive me if I, I know I'm probably gonna say this wrong. Hittitus, Figitus, I don't know if I said that right. Um, real quick, the Yaya's that just joined, I'm briefly on here showing, let's see. This box right here, that went back in front of the Temple Records a while back, it has that was just one CD that I read. Let me put number one back real quick. Number two is currently missing because that one's in my car, but it has three different CDs. And then we're gonna have to skip on to number three because again, like I said, that one is in my car. Um, number three has A Will of a Tale, Old Yeller, Pretty Irish Girl, The Parent Trap, Castle in Spain, Enjoy It. Let's see, where am I at? On the front porch, the monkey's uncle, that darn cat. Ooh, I'm probably gonna say this word wrong as well. Frutosity, Frutosity. I know I probably said that wrong. <laughs> Mickey Mouse Club March. I'm no fool. You the human animal. Let's see. Sorry guys, I lost myself for a minute. Mickey Mouse Club Alma Mater. Wonderful World of Color. That one's one of my favorites. Love hearing that one. The Spectrum Song, The Ballad of Davy Crockett, The Swamp Fox, The Wonderful World of Disney, Zorro, Strum and Song, Mr. Piano Man, DuckTales Theme, of course another favorite, Tailspin Theme, Meet Me Down on Main Street, The Tiki 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 Room, another one of my favorite there, It's a Small World After All, Yo-Ho, A Pirate's Life for Me, there's a great big beautiful tomorrow, golden dream, and Main Street Electrical Parade. Main Street Electrical Parade is actually my ringtone on my phone. And now you guys, sorry, I want to go back to any comments I might have missed because um, there is a lot of songs here. Okay, Jesse Robert Garza, thank you for stopping by. Have a good evening as well. Um, see, sorry guys, I just want to make sure I didn't miss anything. Oh, thank you, Juan, too. Juan shared um, the Kilt Guys link as well. Juan says, when she led me from Toy Story 2, when she remembers, oh, that's a good song too, Juan. Um, let me go look, or not look, well, I meant, I'm sitting right here with you guys, what I meant. Now, it comes with the book. The book might maybe have what the other song, oh, you know what, guys, sorry, take that back. I think the back of the box, sorry, guys, I'm trying to maneuver my stuff around here, has the information as well, since I don't have disc number two with me. Yeah, it does. So number two, oh boy, a tongue twister for me. My son makes fun of this one for me because I have to either say it slow and he can say it fast. But the super cali, it, uh, see, I can't even say it now. Super expialidocious. See, I have to say it kind of slow. I could not say that word fast. It is a tongue twister for me. So this is um, disc number two. A spoonful of sugar, chim chim cherie, Winnie the Pooh, the Bare Necessities, I Want to Be Like You, The Aristocats, Everybody Wants to Be a Cat. Let me stop for a minute and see. Hi, Kim, how are you? Are you dreaming? <laughs> yeah, I know, I decided, um, I wasn't sure if I was almost gonna go live today because I wasn't able to later on this evening and I thought, you know what, I had some free time right now. So I figured, okay, I will, um, you know, come on here and share. I had shared, you know, briefly, Let's see, actually, let me real quickly um, finish off on the songs I was reading off the CD, which, you know what, I already forgot where I was. Like, gosh, I think it just wants me to say that tongue twister word again. Um, I'll kind of repeat. So I was sharing this box has, for those of you that just joined, three CDs in there. And I read off earlier the songs, oh, 
that are in disc number one. And then now I'm reading, I went out of order, but I'm reading number two now, because disc number two is in my car, and I forgot that the back of this lists the songs. I didn't even know how I forgot when I had just shared that with you guys earlier, too. And then I read what songs are number three disc, and now I'm reading what was on disc number two. And yeah, I get to say the tongue twister word again, that I have to say slow, though. The supercalifragilistic expialidocious, a spoonful of sugar, chim chim cheri, Winnie the Pooh, The Bare Necessities, I Want to Be Like You, The Aristocats, Everybody Wants to Be a Cat, The Age of Not Believing, Nobody's Problems, I'm probably going to say this one wrong, <laughs> Udi Lolly, Someone's Waiting for You, Candle on the Water, Best of Friends, Perfect Isn't Easy, Part of Your World, of course that's one of my other favorite songs. Hint, the hint behind the, you know, my name, Part of Rose's World, um, from having to do with that song, my boyfriend actually gave me the idea to, um, he's like, why don't you, you know, name yourself Part of Rose's World, because he's like, since you love that song, Part of Your World, so much. I had to first, you know, think it, think it through and, like, say it out loud, though, at first, you know, I'm like, huh, and then I started liking you know, the, how it sounded and stuff. And I even asked a few friends' opinions as well because I was like, hey, what do I think of this? And then it has Under the Sea, Kiss the Girl, Be Our Guest, and Beauty and the Beast. Boy, that is a lot of songs. And I'm sorry, does I say I want to see what I'm missing? Oh, is it a genie in the DIY? I know when that song comes on, my youngest is even like, oh, like he's thinking, oh my gosh, there goes my mother again singing because I really do <laughs> sing that song out loud along with Let It Go. <laughs> yeah, yes, I'm sorry, it's ringing because he said to Janie that it's nowhere to be found, so you're safe. <laughs> it's so funny. Happy Friday to you too, Kim. So I know just alone, I mean, I'll count in a minute how many songs are on disc two, but um, let's see, total amount of songs on this, though, the first CD has 27 songs. The second one has 30 songs, so that's um, already 57 songs from just two CDs. And then, because I don't have that disc in front of me, it makes it now, let's see. There is a total of 77 songs from the three CDs all together. That is a lot of Disney songs. And <laughs> no I don't even have nowhere to play the songs. I would have to go to my TV and put it in the DVD player. I don't have um what do you call that a like radio with the CD player. Actually, you know, most most I can't even talk. Where I listen to most of my my CDs from are in you know in my car. So I guess um, I kind of briefly. Hi, fishing with Christina. How are you? And then I do not gotta say you know. Hold on, sorry guys. I gotta try to fix myself again. I don't have my the greatest setup over here, and I apologize for that. Um, I know I had said, you know, oh, in five minutes more, and I look at the time like five minutes turns into you know, 10, 15, 20 minutes. Aw, Janine. They were just teasing that, you know, teasing about it though. I mean, I don't wanna get more started on that, but. Okay, well have a good rest of your day at work. Thank you for stopping by. And oh, thank you so much. You know, this is actually, um, you know, something new that I decided to throw out there and, um, Put in the background. I tell um, Brittany I say hi as well. And you guys have um, a great weekend. Mom? Oh, hold on. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay, we'll go. Sorry, guys. My son's just telling me. Um, that he needs help with something. I'm trying to think though, what can I put as your guys' background while I go do that? To go to him, um, won't be very long. Oh, thank you. 
I'll put this by. No, I won't even have much. I'll be right back, you guys. Sorry, give me like a quick two minutes. I'm sorry guys, I almost finished it, but I don't have to I'm sorry about that, you guys. Okay, I'm coming, you guys, sorry. Right, the choice of going live and then you have two boys and if they need help <laughs> okay I'm back sorry about that you guys so this book you know I'm not even sure what is what is going on being silly over there um god let me see I might have to like scoot myself over something because I'm not used to um like trying to share and hold books yes hi um yeah, because you know how I almost do it, like story time. I'm not used to um, well, in a book that way, but I'll kind of briefly show you guys. That's like the first page. And then, okay, wait, that you can't see very well. Um, It just says, like, has introduction, the early years, coming of age, expanding the dream, songs from Tin Pan Alley, the Shermans march through Disney, um, Disney's live action, musical legacy, TV tunes, a song in the parks, and then the song index again, and a musical resonance. I know I probably said that word wrong. Let me see. Let's see if we can see the pictures very well. No, probably not, but I'll show you guys this one. <laughs> one. <laughs> Reading Rainbow Time. They know not about the reading part, but um, just kind of briefly show you guys. Oh, yeah. See, in the back, it has all the songs as well. Ooh, you know what? We'll show you guys real quick. You know what? Let me see. No, you know what? I'll just... Uh, let's see. Maybe this way. I actually got to see that the last time I was at the park in person, the Main Street Electrical Parade. It was pretty cool and awesome. That was my first time, you know, seeing it because when they used to have... Sorry, guys. You know, that parade before, I never got to um, see it back then when it first, you know, came out. Um, but yeah, so there you guys have it. You know, I shared, oops, you know, that doesn't do it very well with the glare, right? That, and then I'll just briefly again kind of share. Oh yeah, thank you, Juan. Yeah, my boyfriend, you know, found it. He came home and he's like, oh, look what I found. Um, I'm pretty sure it was at Dimple Records. It's called... And I was like, oh, how cool is this? And, you know, right away I, like, went through all the songs. And I couldn't, like, I was like, oh, my gosh. Like, it has the Main Street Let's Go Parade. It has just, you know, I can't think all of the songs at the moment. But. Well, thank you, Kim. And your favorite part is it in the, or oh, the Blue Fairy? I'm trying to think. I'm like, so it's been so long that my poor memory is like, oh, I don't remember. Like, I kind of briefly do, but my memory's like, I don't know. I always say that I'm like Dory. If I could, you know, compare myself with um, any Disney or Pixar character. And then I'll just kind of briefly, you know, reshare one more time. We shared all these cool things that came in the amazing party pack through the Disney Movie Club. Hi, all Cruz. How are you? We just kind of all moving. Well, I'm trying to think. Let's see what else. Because I kind of shared all right, everything with you guys. You know, if you guys want to ask anything, um, I'll briefly show again. You know what? Let me hold on. Put the box together for all Cruz. I just joined. All Cruz, I just finished wrapping up sharing. Um, this was the last thing that I shared. This box that it has three different CDs, but over, I believe I counted. There's three CDs total, and it has all three, all three CDs combined together is 77 songs of Disney songs. And then inside, 
It has the music of Disney Legacy in a song book. And then um, the three CDs. It is missing one because that one is in... Oops, sorry about the glare. CD number two is in my car currently. And then in the back... Oh, with the disc coming right on my face, right? <laughs> Let me move those so I don't do that again. And then here's the songs in the back. And my boyfriend, you know, found this at a record store and it is, you know, used, but the condition is actually not that bad. I mean, not the greatest, but it's not that bad. I'm sorry, I'm just kind of moving. I don't know. I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing now. <laughs> okay. Wait, no, let me see. Cause I know, um, you know what guys, I'm not even sure. We I mean, know what, I have my phone to know how the words look if they're backwards or not for you guys but let me see in the meantime um yeah see i know probably the glare won't help either though that i have maybe this way and then if i slowly let's see sorry guys i'm just trying to kind of my best sorry about the lighting and then let me see I'm also, see, I'm because I'm watching from my phone and I'm trying to see if I'm being careful with the lighting because I know I see a glare on there. Oh, wait, I'm going crooked. Sorry about that, you guys. It's kind of hard because I'm trying to watch from my phone and see, like, yeah, see, I know I, I can't keep that straight. I went crooked there. <laughs> I tried. I gotta get, you know, more practice and use to this so then, you know. Like the glaring won't be as bad, but that's more right now because, you know, I don't have quite, you know, the good type of lighting for when I go live, but that is something later down the road, you know, I do plan to get um, the good lighting for that so we don't have so much of a glare. Yeah, so many songs. Or, you know, I don't know why I didn't think. Let me see. I think I might. No, you know what? That won't work because I actually got it in. Take out, let me see. Sorry guys, I'm just trying to see. Oh, you know what, let's see. This is disc one. I don't know why I didn't think of this until right now. Uh, no, I don't know if that, I don't know if I closer or like this is good, you guys. So I'm also, no, probably not. Had to me, it don't look the greatest. That well, because I see a lot of the glare. But that was in the first CD. And then the third CD, because I don't have. Yeah, I do that too sometimes. I'll cruise with the YouTube. Or I also have um, Pandora. I have so many Disney stations on there. And then let's see. I know you probably can't see the greatest ball to show. I don't know why I didn't think to show the smaller paper instead. The only thing is, I don't know how well you guys can see the letters. I mean, to, in my end, it doesn't look like you can. Yeah, see, that's what I kind of thought. I just figured, I'm like, well, I'll just kind of share them. Hey, Walto Grams, how are you? But that's what that, you know, had all those, that many CDs there. And then I'll just briefly recap and share, you know, and then these are the two DVDs we got to the Disney Movie Club, The Little Mermaid, that has the... 4K Ultra HD, Blu-ray, and the digital code, and then The Little Mermaid 2, Return to the Sea, and The Little Mermaid Ariel's Beginning. Yeah, um, Walter Rams Little Mermaid. And then I had shared, I got the, um, some amazing party pack that they were offering as well. And it had all these different things in there. There's um, recipes, stickers, tattoos, these little like mermaid treat bags. Um, egg stands and then like a little game where you pin almost like pin the tail on the donkey but you're putting Sebastian on Ariel's tail is how they uh, made that game and then the lithograph and then I'll go back briefly to sharing the messenger bag from Ralph Breaks the Internet yeah, but there you have it, guys. You know, everything I just wanted to share, you know, with you guys. If you guys, uh, I can't even, gosh, I don't know why I'm getting tongue twisted so much. If you guys want to ask, you know, any 
questions or anything. Oh yeah, me um, too, Kim. I want to see The Little Mermaid again. Even though, I mean, I've seen it quite a few times. I know it's another movie my son doesn't like to watch with me because when Part of Your World <laughs> comes on, he's like, oh boy, thinking, am I a mom? There she goes singing again or Under the Sea. Can't help it though, right? Uh, the lithograph. You know what, guys? So I got to learn how to like, I don't know how to share stuff and then... Look at the stream as well. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, and then like I said, any last minute thing you guys want to see, I'll kind of, you know, have everything still out here in the open so you guys can see again. Because if I went too fast, I didn't mean to. Sorry about that. <laughs> I was under the sea. I bet I can only imagine my poor neighbors as well, multigrams. You know, when the Disney songs come on, and especially to, I mean, I love so many Disney songs, but especially to those that I, um, you know, sing my heart out to, which would be like, oh, what do you call it? Under the Sea, um, Part of Your World, Let It Go, In Summer. Those are a few of my songs that I, um, what do you call it? I can't even think, sing my heart out more out loud too. Uh, but let's see, so I don't want to miss. And I think Juan's trying to get me to read so I can sing it, huh, Juan? I know, so I think I was telling my son, I go, because I do plan, well, it's not yet official, but I'm hoping to, uh, or not hoping to see, I will possibly be going to the parks this year for Halloween time. I mean, I won't get yet give a specific date, of course, but it will be for the Halloween time. <laughs> You do the same, Janine. Oh, you don't get those um, lithographs, multigrams in the UK? Oh no. Is that the fish is that fly over the boat? I laugh in the part where, who is it? Um, I want to say, I believe, oh gosh, I hope I'm telling you, I should say his name right, right? Scuttle, when he starts saying that he's going to sing the song in his voice. And <laughs> so funny. Sing, <laughs> I don't know. I just laugh because I know part one, like, oh, back to, I was saying, sorry, I don't mean to get distracted either, but I'm also trying to, you know, keep up with your guys' um, comments. Yeah, on that part, when the temple is this thing, wah, wah, wah. Um, hold on, let me go, yeah, read your guys' comments first. But yeah, I can't wait to see that, the um, Disney live action of Dumbo. Um, I was telling my son that I gotta get ready to kind of practice my singing because I know you know when I get to meet up with Juan if you know if I go during Halloween time this year he's gonna ask for a song request and of course you know I will do it back but because you know it's only fair because I you know have super chatted on like um what well, sometimes I super chat or sometimes I don't but Juan's a good sport and he will sing song requests that I request of him to do um, it was, oh, what do you, I can't even think, yeah, Christmas songs, I can't even think right now, oh my, the Christmas song anymore, um, I want to say, it's not Last Christmas, Last Christmas is my favorite song, the one from my, oh, All I Want for Christmas, that was, um, a big song request that I would have Juan do, I think the latest song request was on the Kilt Guy stream, um, the DuckTales theme song, so as I said, I gotta get ready to, you know, sing as one's gonna have a request for me if I get to meet him this year. <laughs> um. Oh, okay, I'm sure you're not a terrible, no one's a terrible singer. We all try. See the whole, sorry, I don't think there goes one. <laughs> uh, I almost wanted to like say it, but they're like, I don't know. That life is like a hurricane. There you go, Juan. That's <laughs> all you're going to get from now. <laughs> but I am prepared. Like I said, if we get to beat, you know, that I said Juan is going to um, ask for a song request. Oh, Walton Grams. But that's good. See, you don't let it stop you. But yeah, it's like I said, anything else? Because now I know for sure. See, this is a funny thing. You know, I thought, oh, um, you know, I'll at least get be on here for um, 30 minutes, another 30 minutes later, but 
now for sure, you know, we are almost hitting the um, one hour mark and and hopefully you can't even hear it during the stream, but my stomach is starting to growl a little bit. Then I'm like, okay, I need to um, go have dinner soon. Anything else? Um, so it's about like five more minutes. You guys want to ask or say, hi, Marianne, how are you? Um, trying to think, I guess, you know, I can show again the stuff especially for Mary Ann that just joined. Oh, you know what, you guys, but see, that's the only thing, see where I have, I try to keep it kind of with the theme of stuff that I share, but I do have in front of me over there, my Funko Pops, the, oh gosh, I forget the sizes of them. I wanna say, I don't know if it's 10 inch, it's Truthless and Jack-Jack. Oh, that's nice, Bax. Yeah, the, you know, community is very great and awesome here. Um, you know, I guess I'll wait for any last-minute questions. I think I will grab those because they are, again, just right over here across from me in front of me. Maybe I'll just show, uh, or maybe I'll show both. Here is, oh, let me see if I can get the glare out, though. Jack, Jack. And then, hold on, let me, I see your comment, Jellies, real quick, let me finish sharing this, and I will go read what Jelly Journeys is, Jelly's Journeys, gosh, I can, I don't know why I'm getting tongue, tongue twisted today, is asking me, but there's, sorry, guy, I know, I'm sorry, I apologize about that glare. And then I'll show the other one in a minute, but let me go see, I see a question pop up, and any pictures of friends I heard, and... The, let's see. Before I share the other Funko Pop, let me see Jolly Journey. So I'm not sure if there is. She's asking if there's any pictures of Prince Philip in here. And sorry guys, well, I look, don't mean to look down at the stream. I'm trying to kind of briefly look and see if there's any pictures of, oh, but you know, real quickly while looking. Oh, sorry guys, I'm trying to get that glare out. How cool is that? We're looking for Prince Philip for Jelly's Journeys. Yeah, I figured there should be. Let's see. So far, I'm not seeing any, but I'm going to keep. While well, looking over, how cool, real quick, I'll show. That's pretty cool. I'm not seeing any Jelly's Journeys. Oh, why wouldn't they? Because I know I'm kind of briefly looking there, but if I happen, in case I missed it, I will go back and look. And if I do come across a photo, but I don't think I did see one, I will post it on my um, Facebook group because I know you're part of the group there. But I don't know, I didn't see no pictures of Prince Philip. And oh, thank you, Alcris. I actually ended up, I got it at Target. I have one, I believe, I think it's, I think, the 10 inch Funko Pops, I think. Oh, okay, Marianne, well, you know, drive safe. Hopefully, I know it's usually traffic time, but hopefully there isn't too bad of traffic. But I know it is, as we call it, our traffic time. Okay, El Cruz, well, thank you for stopping by, and it was great to see you, too. Have a great weekend as well. Okay, let me go grab the, this one, it's Toothless, from How to Train Your Dragon, The Hidden World. And these were actually, this one says only at Target. You know what, sorry, guys, bear with me. I know that, uh, let's see, I know, I don't like that glare. You know what, let me see something. No, but you know what, I think if I turn off the light, it will get darker, and I don't. Let me try. I'm going to turn off the light real quick, see if it helps to better show the Funko Pop. And you guys, how does it even look with the light off? Is the light needed? Okay, now I think the glare's from the sunlight, though. But there's 
to assess the dragon. And then you can see there at the back. Yeah, but let me know, you guys, if I do, I need to turn the light back on. I, for, just for now at the moment, I turned it off to kind of help a little bit, but I think what the glare is causing more, it's from the sunlight. But there's the toothless, the dragon. Sorry, guys, I'm just putting them back over there. I don't know what, I should probably remove this from the back of my, our poor dwarf hamster back there. Yeah, they're big size chaining. I know when my when I showed up with those, I'm like, where am I gonna put those Funko Pops? They're too big. I already have um well I wasn't you know too many Disney things things that I still haven't even finished sharing with you guys yet. Oh hold on, sorry guys, what did I miss? Uh oh, you can't find your sleeping beauty movie anywhere. Oh no. I hope you find it. I know how that goes. We had lost um, Ralph Breaks the Internet. And then I forget it was inside somewhere. And then now we found the DVD, but now I can't find the case to put it in. Oh, you got the... Uh, see, that's, it. that's another character name where I get tongue twisted saying Maleficent. I hope I said that right. You got her at Target. That's awesome. Uh, yep, yeah, I haven't seen the newest one after that from how to, the How to Train Your Dragon movies. Um, me and my boys want to catch up and watch those. Juan <laughs> said that was laughing too. Yeah, it is a big size though. Janine of the Funko Pops. Juan said that Cheaper's Creepers Monster. Well, thank you, Disney World Adventures. So yeah, guys, while we finish up, you know, wrapping up anything else you guys want to share or ask before we um, end the stream. And then also briefly say, again, one more time, you know, I also don't quickly want to say you guys, you know, I mean, I won't say um, names, but I mean, it's nothing bad, but it's um, some of you have friend requested me on Facebook. And I want to say you guys, I actually, um, you know, don't want to no longer accept um, friend requests there because I do want to be able to have like you know one so social media kind of more like to myself to be able to post you know like family pictures and stuff um, but if you guys would like you know for those of you that have friend requested me on Facebook I have a part of Rose's World um, group where you guys can I mean I'll have to you know of course accept the um, request for it but you know where it's a Disney family friendly group where you guys can share you know I think Disney related whether you know pictures of your Disney trips um, or past pictures you know from trips or you know um, pictures of your things that you collect you know of Disney or Pixar or um, like even you know funny Disney memes I love seeing those because I actually have been sharing quite a few of those I also posted on there on the I think on both on the because I also have a page there's part of Rose's world page on Facebook and there's also part of Rose's world group as well um, but for you guys to share anything you know Disney related as long as we you know keep it family friendly or if you guys you know also want to ask any Disney related questions you guys can you know post it on there as well and I also um, am on Instagram at part of Rose's world Oh, okay, Nikki, no problem, but thank you for um, stopping by back again. I'm actually, we're getting ready to, um, you know, wrap up and say goodbye. And tell Ari I say hi. Yes, sir, I'm just reading your guys' comments. And have a good um, evening, Nikki, and a great weekend as well. And also, I'm not sure, you know, I hope I didn't miss her saying bye to you, but tell Marseille as well, you know, that was fun and awesome seeing her here in the chat with us. But Nikki, you and, you know, all the family, you guys have, you know, a good evening and um, a good weekend. 
and thank you for stopping by. I'm glad you were able to make it. Um, cause I do want to say again briefly, Nikki, I do for sure, you know, go lives on Mondays. Um, I try to, you know, go live around 6 p.m. Pacific time. Friday, sometimes yet, I haven't yet, you know, exactly, um, been able to like go live all the time. So those ones will kind of, you know, be random the Friday streams, but I will try, you know, my best to when I do go live, I try to remember to, oh, let me go post it, you know, on my Facebook page and group and, you know, the Instagram to kind of help out, you know, as a reminder too, because I know sometimes, you know, on here, you don't always get all your notifications because that actually happens to me sometimes too and it drives me crazy. I'm like, why am I not getting my notifications? But also again, you know, thank you to all of you then. If no one has any other last minute thing you guys want to ask, um, you know, thank you to everyone that was here and those of you also that were here earlier, you know, even stopped by for a little bit. I appreciate, you know, each and every one of you for being here. You know, it's always fun. And that's the other thing too, you know, why I'm like, man, I'm like, we can keep going and going, you know, but, um, like I said, it's dinner time for me. My tummy keeps, you know, growling and telling me, okay, you need to go eat. <laughs> but thank you again, you know, for everyone. Appreciate all of you. It was fun, you know, sharing all this stuff here that I have. Now, thank you, Disney World Adventures. You have a magical night as well. And, yes, yeah, see you real soon. I'm sorry, guys. I just, like I said, I have you guys on my phone over here. Oh, okay, Kim. I'm glad you're back. And all oh, you're welcome. Thank you for being here. Oh, you're welcome. Um, Janine Disney DIY, thank you as well, too, you know, for being here as well. Sorry, guys. I think I said what I'm going to try to do, what I've noticed, I don't mean to do. You know, I like kind of say goodbye and briefly get off, but that way, as you guys are saying bye, so I can say, you know, goodbye to everyone. Because what I want to try to avoid, I know sometimes, you know, I miss saying bye to some of you guys. And that's not, you know, what um, I want to try my best to, you know, say goodbye to each and every one of you. But bye, Max. Thank you for being here as well. See, that's why I don't want to start from here. But I know Juan, thank you for being here as well. And yes, Kim, happy Friday and a great weekend to you as well, Kim. And yes, everyone have a happy Friday, um, you know, day or evening. Because sometimes I forget, you know, some of us are in different, different, I can't, gosh, I don't know why I keep getting tongue twisted. Some of us are in different time zones is what I meant to say. Bye, Jelly's Journeys. Thank you for being here. Have a good night as well. But yeah, you know, everyone have a good day or evening. And, you know, everyone have a good weekend as well. And I'm sure some of us, you know, will see each other on other, um, God, I can't even talk, on other streams. And then, sorry, guys, if I look down again, like I said, I have you guys, the chat over here. So I try my best to not, you know, miss any comments. But let's see, I'm not sure. Did I get everybody so far? I think that is in here, I think. Again, I do apologize, though, if I miss anybody I don't mean to but thank you you know to all of you oh and then you know what cargo was in here too so if I had a cargo I'll cruise so this is where I mean I don't want to do because I'm going to forget somebody um Marseille Nikki the Yaya Chronicles Marianne oh that's right you know Marianne because I know you're listening and driving but um thank you for being here, Marianne, and, you know, stopping and chatting and also, um, you know, listening. But I hope you have a good evening as well and a good weekend, Marianne. Sorry, guys, I'm just kind of coming back. So this is where I mean, well, I got to kind of do that because I don't want to forget anybody. Walto Grams was in here earlier. Thank you for being here, Walto Grams. Have a good weekend. Oh, you guys, I'm so sorry. Wait, ooh, I don't want to do that. This is why I don't want to scroll up. I almost clicked. I hope I didn't do anything. This is why sometimes I don't like scrolling back because it pops up almost like an option. It's like action. I'm like, no, I don't want to do anything. I'm just trying to scroll and see if I missed anybody. Oh, no. 
I don't think it did anything though, hopefully. <laughs> I'm gonna be in trouble too if I did. 